So I was just about to talk you through the right hand side, so make sure you add a tour place here on the right um, and a tour type as well. So it can go under multiple again, um, and that's over to you guys. And then finally, you add a featured image here. So when, once you add a featured image to the website, it will show up right away, which is obviously really important. Um, the size for the images that we are using are 2,700 pixels by 735 pixels. That's important um, to make sure it's not too big, not too small. So um, basically, if you upload full resolution images to the website, that's really bad practice because it takes ages for people to download it to their, uh, their phones or, or their computers. So standard practice is to crop the images to the right size. Once you've done all of that, you can hit update, um, and that will publish straight to the website. You can also click on edit here, or if you haven't published one, it'll just say um, schedule. And what you can do is um, schedule a tour to go live. So if you have some free time and know some upcoming tours, you don't want to be on the website yet, but you can add the information. You can schedule it in by just changing that. And then when you press this, this button will change to schedule. Um, and it will just mean that you can, you can proactively get tours up, but you don't want them live on the website yet. That's all there is to it. It's really, really easy to add. We've spent a lot of time making it um, as simple as it can be, so you don't need to worry about any code. You can just get the core information in there with images, and it will go up straight away. So this part will hopefully be very quick for you. Um, you can go into any of these and edit them. You've got full access. Um, let me know if you have any issues.